What's up, you guys? How are y'all doing today? It's been forever since we caught up. I hope everything is good on your guys' side. I hope this year is treating you really well. I've had so many life changes. I'm currently sitting in my new apartment in Denver, Colorado. We officially moved out of California. We were building a home the past 15 months. And basically, long story short, um, some things didn't pan out the way we expected in the last few months. So we decided to rent in the city and look for a different home in a different area. No tea, no shade. But I'm gonna save that story for another time. Today, I just wanna get back into reconnecting with you guys. I'm so grateful for you to even be here hanging out with me today. And I love you guys so much. Let's go ahead and get into it. All right, so for today's video, I wanted to share all of my favorite winter basics that I have been loving. I wanted to share some of the things I've been wearing on repeat. Everything mentioned in today's video will be down below in that description bar. First store and the majority of today's items are all gonna be from Uniqlo. I stocked up on so much heat tech before I left. I took my mom and Jeremy to Uniqlo and I was like, let's ball out. Their heat tech collection, you guys, is so bomb. I was never really an environment for me to wear all the time. The great thing about the heat tech collection is that there are three levels of warmth. You got the regular, the extra warm, and the ultra warm. So some of my favorites that I collected are the camisole. I find that this is a really like super thin and silky, great as a pajama top or also layered under really bulky things like a sweater like this, where I just want a little bit of extra oomph on my torso and tummy area, but my arms are free to like do what they want. <laughs> Next favorite is also some turtlenecks. I have such a short neck, so I don't want things that are crazy, crazy bulky, because literally like I've got a big ass head and a short ass neck. Like I like things a little bit more silky smooth and slim. I like also that they have the basic black and white colors and also they have these really cute colorful ones. So I got this red turtleneck for a little pop of color. I literally bought Jeremy his own entire set because he loved these so much too. He likes the long sleeve and the simple t shirts work really well also. The ultra warms are the highest level of warmth. It's almost like fully fleece lined. It keeps you so warm, but you're not hot and sweaty. It is just like the perfect thing to wear. I almost didn't even need to layer anything on top of this. This is just a great standalone t-shirt. Pretty much just throwing it on every day anyway because it's so cold outside, so. <laughs> Moving on to other items that I got at Uniqlo, you guys, their sweatshirt game is so good right now. One of my favorite pieces that I purchased is going to be just their simple crew neck sweatshirt. This is like, to me, the sweatshirt of my dreams. It's thick, it's got this terry cloth feeling on the inside. I love that like very dry, matte, cottony, terry cloth feeling, it just, Feels so snuggly, but not sweaty, you know? I love these dolman sleeves too, because you can just not have your uh, stinky armpit sweat like touching the fabric all the time. And then if you're looking for an even heavy duty style, they have a super sized, longer hoodie with actual pockets in the front and a full thick, hoodie on the top, which I love. So you can insulate your head underneath your parka. It's crazy oversized, but it's just insanely comfortable. It feels like you're all wrapped up in a nice Snuggie. Moving on to one of my favorite basics in today's video. And not only that, they're so affordable at like $15. Their waffle tees, you guys are so good. These are a thick waffle knit nubby t-shirt that is so cute and substantial. I was just completely obsessed with these two different colors. This is the gray color in this heather oatmeal flecked material and then also just this plain beige oatmeal color. If you're into those neutrals, minimalist colors and you like to layer them on top, I love throwing in something like this because that waffle knit texture differentiates things as you're layering, you know, creams and neutral tones on top of each other. And for a nice basic tee option, this is the Uniqlo mock neck tee. This one is a longer, almost like half sleeve t-shirt, but it also has a mock neck on top. It's just like a really nice hybrid, a great transitional piece for spring, especially if it's getting hotter for where you guys are at. I love the fact that this is a really nice, thick, opaque t-shirt, which is sometimes very hard to find. I can't tell you how crazy thick and stretchy this t-shirt is. Very elevated. I love it. I love it. Next up, this is the Uniqlo Crew Neck Souffle Yarn Sweater. If souffle yarn wasn't like the most perfect, snuggly term for a sweater, I was looking for just a basic, neutral, gray sweater, and I found that this was like absolutely perfect. Very stretchy. Such a high quality sweater for $30. Into the soft, snuggly stuff because it's like 30 degrees outside so definitely check this out if you're into something that's more soft and woven and just deliciously cozy <laughs> and then for some pjs this is the uniqlo stretch sweatshirt two-piece set in the jogger collection you guys we were wearing this like all throughout the road trip it's so stretchy comfortable this is a terry cloth feeling sweatshirt set but it's incredibly thin and stretchy i've been living in these two-piece sets jeremy wears his all the time also like separating the pieces like i'm wearing the black 
color right now on the bottom. They're just the perfect things to throw on and just lounge around all day long, but they're also elevated enough to wear outside. I literally got one for my mom, one for Jeremy, and two for myself. Sorry. And last but not least from Uniqlo, I just picked these up on a whim. These are the Uniqlo Stretch Legging Jean Pants, and I cannot believe that you were able to select your own alterations online. So I asked for a 27 inch inseam, and they were perfectly altered exactly to my preferred length out of the box. I think that's fantastic. They even have legit pockets in the back, belt loops, like they look so much like a real pair of jeans with realistic fading and washing. This was the perfect perfect thing to switch up from my sweatpants and leggings repertoire. So those are the more casual items for two premium sweaters I really loved are from Everlane. They are from their cashmere and re-cashmere line. If you guys are cashmere fans, you guys, I pretty much only buy my cashmere at Everlane. More ethical, sustainable standards and the quality is fantastic, especially for the price point. The first one that I got is going to be the mock neck raglan cashmere sweater. I got this during their choose what you pay sale and it was perfect because I love this Heather Java color. It's a nice basic but it's a little bit different than my blacks, grays, and whites and creams. This chocolate coffee color is so beautiful. Just the right amount of looseness to feel comfortable, but it's still tailored enough to look refined for an elevated look. Then the next cashmere piece that I picked up, I've been just really drowning in lots of mock necks and crew necks, and I wanted something just to change it up a little bit, so I picked up something from their re-cashmere line. It's made with recycled Italian yarn, but it still has the same soft, luxurious feel as a regular cashmere. It's got 50% less carbon footprint, which I think is really, really cool, and I literally cannot tell the difference between the quality of their regular cashmere and their re-cashmere. It almost feels like a preppy sweatshirt, but it's got this beautiful rib detailing along the neckline, more boxy feel. It's cropped, and it also has this adorable pocket detailing on the chest too. All right guys, and final items in today's video are gonna be accessories. For a random affordable find that I stumbled across Amazon, they have these Carhartt acrylic beanies that are under $20. I think they're actually made for men's, but I got such a big ass head, they fit perfectly. I got this really cute nubby caramel color Color one. For under $20, this beanie is so thick and warm. I love the thick band in the front. It is just so perfectly warm and neutral for any of my outfits. And it also has a cute little sporty touch because of the little tag right there. Then for a more luxurious premium option, this is the Madewell Cashmere Ribbed Beanie. I got this in this light gray color and also simple black that I can't find right now. I'm so, I hope I didn't lose it. <laughs> it's a little bit pricey, but this is a really nice option for a non-cuffed beanie. And then my last one is a more affordable option from Madewell. This one is the Kent beanie. It almost has the same silhouette as this thicker ribbed cashmere one, but it's a little bit thinner. And I love this. I'm just like really feeling these chocolate coffee tones right here. But this one is also super cute. Minimal, sleek, a little bit of a excess reservoir here. <laughs> And then finally for scarves, I picked up these the second I saw them on the site. These are the Everlane Wool Cashmere Oversized Scarves, and I really love oversized ones because I get just full coverage whenever it's crazy outside. These were the perfect mix because you have just the sturdy warmth of the wool, but the softness of the cashmere to kind of offset that typical scratchiness you feel with wool. I thought this was the perfect minimalist forever scarf. I bought them in every single color. If you guys are thinking of revamping and just kind of minimizing your scarf collection. I think that you can never go wrong with these really beautiful solid colors that will match with everything and can last for many years. All right, you guys, that does it for today's video. Thank you so much for hanging out with me today, for having patience as I like kind of get back into the groove of things. I'm really ready for this fresh start and I just, I love you guys so much. I hope you have an amazing day out there and I'll talk to you guys really soon. Bye.